Я готовился в Махачкале, еще в зале, в клубе имени Гаджи Махачева. А, увидимся в ринге. Спортсмен из Бразилии. Приветствуйте! Рандер Джулио! Now is the time for the second fight of the evening. And first fighter in the blue corner, Rander Junior from Brazil, 27 years old, 6 and 0 in professional mixed martial arts. BJJ Brown Bells, national champions in BJJ. Another interesting young prospect with very good jiu-jitsu. Six and all undefeated. Another big lightweight. We saw Mansur Barnawi just in the previous fight. Uh, Rander Junior cut 13 kilos before that fight. He used to be 83 kilos just three days ago. All, all six of his previous fights he made on a, on a national level in Brazil against fellow Brazilians. So now it's time for him to make some noise, make, make some waves in, in M1 on an international stage. I think nobody would, would be surprised if Rander will try to take his opponent down and work and use his grappling skills to submit him. Although it's Rander Junior, Brasilia, Shiremoglo! И его соперник в красном углу рейджа представляет клуб Fight Spirit Колпина. Приветствуйте! Ислам Махаче! Now it's time for Randers opponent. Islam. Beaten prospects. Makhachev versus Makhachev. Junior. Fight Spirit, Kopina, in the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a super fight in the lightweight division. Let me introduce your fighter in the blue corner. 
This fighter is 27 years old. He weighed in at 70.3 kilograms. He stands 178 centimeters tall and has a professional record of six wins with no losses. He is a Jiu-Jitsu world champion and Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu champion and a brown belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. Fighting out of Brazil, Rande Juno. And now for his opponent in the red corner. This fighter is 21 years old. He weighed in at 70.2 kilograms. He stands 180 centimeters tall and has a professional record of eight wins and no losses. He is two times a Russian and world combo champion. He is a grappling champion from Fight Spirit, Kalapino Islam Makachev. And your referee is Mika Sikonin. So it's time to start another <coughs> another fight. Mahajev versus Rander. Eight and all versus six and all. Russia versus Brazil. So let's start. Oh. oh, nice body kick there to start off this fight. Oh. Well, the Brazilian said he was going to stand. He doesn't want to go to the ground. And it, it's quite interesting considering that five of his uh, six victories, he it came, came by submissions. He never won by KO or TKO. Well, I mean, sometimes people like to, you know, they pretend they're going to stand. But, you know, such a guy is a YouTube world champion. And you can see he wants to take it to the ground, taking the back now of Makachev. Makachev has very good takedown defense because he, he, he has very good specialists in his team. His coach is the main coach of the uh, Pakistan Combat Samba team. So, oh, no. Well, Julio, he takes it to the ground, but he gets guard. And I'm sure uh, Jiu Jitsu, ground belt world champion, will be quite happy to land in the guard. It's a good position for oh, BJJ champion. He feels comfortable in this position so far. He's trying to probably go for triangle. But now, now he's setting up his moves. Well, Makachev comfortably just throwing a little hammer fist there. More annoying than anything else. But you can see the wrist control that uh, Junior is doing. Junior grabbed the wrist control, he pushed the hand through, go for a triangle. it would be very slick from this position. Yeah, but, uh, in, there you go, see, see him just working high. The legs are coming up high, pushing the arm through. Well, Mika sinking and decides to stand him up, yeah. To stand it up. Well, let's see if Rando Junior, he said his striking will be a lot better than Makachev. Let's see if it is. Or was it just a ploy to keep it on the ground? And by the way, Makachev himself told that he's going to... Oh, beautiful! Oh, no, no, is it single leg takedown? He goes to be careful, going to get his back taken. And again, Makachev is on the top. And there is... See, see how clever Junior is using the using the rage there, using the walls of the rage to swing his body around. Normally, you can do that up against the cage if you're in octagon, and you can you climb up high, swing the legs around, and work for the armbar. But Makachev, I think, seeing that, manages to push the body out. Well, stars in the judge's eyes, it's two takedowns for Makachev, so... Yeah, so pr probably now Makachev is leading and, and, and Makachev's coach telling him not, 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 to, not, not to give up. He, he, he's, he, he, he's be very careful with his arms because, because obviously the Brazilian guy is very, very dangerous with submissions, especially with arm bars, arm blocks. And uh, Makachev's coach is well aware of that and, yeah, again. The referee is standing them up. Second time in this fight. Oh. High kick from Makachev. Oh, Junior should throw some more kicks. His body kicks work well. Oh, nice. Oh, good. Beautiful left hook to follow. But Brazilian guy recovered very fast and now he's, he's again trying to. Trying to move forward. There's a couple of punches. Not, not so successful. Oh, 
I'm sure Junior would love to see this on the ground with him on top. Not being on top thus far. One minute, 15 seconds left of the first round. Left, left, left. It's it's uh, Makachev's coach really want him to, to set up his moves with a with a jab, but it oh, but instead Brazilian guy is moving forward, going to clinch. Yeah, Junior, I think um, he is using his strikes like he said he would in the interview, but I don't think he's using his strikes to finish the game. He's using his strikes to close that gap. Get the clinch and then go for the takedown. Yeah, Ma Makachev's team is well known by, by takedowns, by, by the throws and takedowns. And now that's exactly what he's trying to do. Yeah, nice double body oh. lock there. Good knee. Well, good takedown defense there from Junior. Uh, oh, oh. But not that time. Once again, in the guard of Makachev. Yeah, and it was the last 10 seconds of the fight. So, yeah, probably Makachev took, took this round for sure. Yeah, for sure. Three good takedowns. That, you know, the stand-up work of Junior was good. He used the body kicks better than he used the strikes. But when he did use the strikes, Junior, he used it to close the gap and to clinch. But every time Makachev... He capitalized on that clinching up the takedown three times in round one. Yeah, but also it was nothing that nothing that uh, Makachev was wasn't too Shopping too there. active from from the top. In, 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 when when he was in the guard because it, it was this, almost the same situation in his previous fight with Mansoor Barnoi. He took Mansoor down quite easily, but then when he was in guard in his guard from the top, he didn't that didn't do too much. He 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 was holding on. He he was trying to punch him, but with no visible effect. Yeah, a lot of people think round and pound is just a matter of laying on your opponent and throwing shots. It's not. It, it, I look at ground and pound as a skill, just like boxing is, just like kickboxing is, you know? You open up your opponent, you, you know, you set them up with different shots to, to drop the arm, to make a space, to yeah, capitalize. True, true. There are a lot of technical nuances, so it's it's interesting to see what, what Makachev is going to make, to do in the second round. Is, is he going to change his technique or is he going to keep, keep, keep on going to the clinch and uh, take his opponent down? Well, to be honest, Al, his, his, his technique is actually working right now, although it's not purely exciting from a, from a spectator's point of view. Yeah. It's, it's winning the round. It's oh, winning absolutely. The fight. He, he clearly won the first round and he's on his way <laughs> probably to, to, to win the second if, if, if he, it, it will continue like that. Then rolls in the guard. Junior could. A good triangle attempt, triangle attempt. No, not good, not high enough. Legs were not high enough. Makachev's coach doesn't want him to be in a guard. He, he's just told, like, just go away, just go to stand up. Just stand up, don't, don't stay in his guard. See the wrist control. Normally, when the wrist control are out, they're going to push the arm through between the legs like that and work high for the triangle. That's exactly what he's doing. But I see what you mean there, Stas, by his ground and pound. There's, not, there's nothing vicious in it, is there? You know, he's just quite happy to sit there. It's, it's effective, but yeah, it's, it's not, not that entertaining, maybe, but it's, it's effective. He, he, he's getting his goals, he's achieving his goals. But now. I'm quite surprised that the um, that the Brazilian is, although he's you know he's trying the other other attempt for, for for triangle, he's not very active off his back, you know. Yeah, not not, not as active as, as he could be, true. As he expected. You no, know, you've got someone in your guard. That's the best position to have them in if you want to finish with the submission. And being a BGG guy. No. Yeah. See, then strikes. All the strikes are for the junior is to close that distance. He worked well with the body kicks, he should try them. There we go. And again. Oh, good body kick. He heard me. <laughs> and retaliated by Makachev. Calma, olha no jogo. Calma, 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 cal
Now probably run there is setting up another oh. single leg take on it now. High kick, another high kick from Makachev. Some action in the stand up. Oh. Yeah, Makachev clearly got the the better of the strikes. I saw that, I actually saw that I was gonna say that was a, a fun kick low blow. But I thought Makachev was just gonna sugar off. Obviously accidental. Quite happy to continue. Yeah. He's okay. It he, he didn't take too, too much time for him to recover. Oh, nice trick. Very good oh, kick from the floor. Oh, now he's looking for the leg lock. See, no, he got his back. That's what Junior needs to do. Yeah, Junior was trying to go to, for heel hook, but yeah, it's what it's. Well, the stand up I definitely give to Makachev. His hands are a lot crisper. Yeah. Hitting the target a lot more. Yeah, moving faster, stronger punches. Yeah. And this component is definitely better than the Brazilian guy. Oh, and another single leg. Outside trip needs to trip. Oh, and this guy gets it. Now he's on Finally, top. Yeah. Brazilian guy is not top, so we will see what, what he's going to do from that position. Very interesting. Oh, my Jeff Climbing here looks like he's going to work for the arm. Well, the guards wide open. Junior should be passing this. Not favorable position on side or even go to mount from there, but Makachev now closes guard. Oh, beautiful work there. Turns into an arm bar. The Brazilian guard ball could be tapped in the arm bar, but he pulls out. Beautiful escape there. Yeah, great, great move by Makachev. Yeah, again. Well, to be honest, it was the first time we saw Makachev on his back in guard, and he, as we talked about earlier, more active from his back. Oh, Makachev was working a lot more better than what the Brazilian Jiu Jitsu guy was doing. Last 10 seconds to fight. Makachev is on top again. Yeah, Makachev finished this round off really strong. You've got to give it two rounds to Makachev. Yeah. For sure. Well, another fantastic round there for Makachev. Hey, it's interesting because he, he was trying to avoid the takedowns, but as soon as he, he was on his back, he was he was very active. He was yeah working on on armbar, and it, it will be very interesting to see him on a bottom in a, in a bottom position again. If, if it will be another successful takedown from from Brazilian guy. From now, Rander is really needs to, to go for submission or TKO, something. Because, because he's, he's down by two rounds, he really needs to finish his opponent now. Well, sitting on the canvas like that, looks like Rander Junior is tired. The Makachev saw that, that gives you a little bit of a boost, to be honest. As a fighter myself, if you see your opponent that's tired, it, you know, you think to yourself, right, suck it up, second win, let's go. Yeah, definitely the better of the stand up there, Makachev. Stronger, more powerful punches. Well, you definitely can't criticize the kicks, as you know. Another good punch from Islam. Right. 
and there is is, is setting up an, another <laughs> single leg. Take down. Up there's the end. Oh, punch, that's punch, the and best and shot that Junior has thrown. Oh, yeah. and again, clean. Oh, he pulls guard. Typical Brazilian Jiu Jitsu guy pulling guard. Well, we're seeing he wasn't successful the last time down here. But Rander really needs to work off his back if, he, the rubber if, guard. if, if he wants to. Yeah. 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 Decides to leave it. Well, Junior is two rounds down. He needs to work. He needs to do something. Yeah, and Islam understands that now, now, now he's, a good, he's in a good position. He, as soon as uh, Rander doesn't do anything and doesn't do too much, doesn't set up any submissions. That's and better ground and pound stars. That's, that's a lot yeah, now, now, now he's more and more active. It's interesting. He, Islam is a kind of slow, slow starter. Now, now he's working he's in more. second win. Yeah, his punches are more strong and more powerful. Stop. Yeah, Junior is fatigued now. He's guessed out a little bit, so it would be tough, tough three last minutes for him. Especially considering oh, that he really good. needs to be active. Two left hooks in a row, he actually catches, there's a high kick. Now, oh, oh me. Megachev decides to, do, to get a takedown of his own here. Yeah, he's scoring points, he's winning, he's winning the, the eyes of the judges. He knows as well, he knows that Randers Junior is tired. Three and a half minutes left. Do you know what the problem is? Junior is tired, so his, his, his submission attempts are kind of slow. Makachev can see them. And he understands that he's winning the fight, so he's not in a hurry. He's just trying to keep his position to work. To, and now... Okay. Climbing high for the triangle. But it wouldn't be easy, especially in the third round. Yeah, Makachev too strong. I think he's just going to pull out of this. He's actually going to possibly go back inside. Referee shown for action. Yeah, Makachev needs to move forward. The Makachev's in no danger. He knows he's in no danger. So yeah, he's, he's quite happy to just sit there. Yeah, he's, he's going to let the seconds here, take yeah, by. He's not nervous about, about that position. Stop. Sure. And yeah, referee finally stopped. The fight and stand, stands fighters up. The power of the shots is still there for Makachev. Okay, in the third round, Makachev didn't slow down too much compared to first round. That's true. I think he's picked the pace, to be honest. He's picked it up just a little bit. Mm. Got into his second win. He knows Junior's tired. Wants to win this round impressively. And, and that he's doing, I mean, he's the, the takedown there. That's just to prove he's in control and he's on top. So Junior's trying for Kimura. Yeah, he's going for the Kimura. But yeah, in this position, he has hands way underneath. It's not, it's not that much chances to make it. 30 seconds. Well, he needs to pull it off quick. 25 seconds of the final round. He needs to rip that arm out if he can. I think Makachev is just too clever. He'll be buried in tight down there. Grab a hold of his own shorts, which is perfectly legal. Yeah, yeah Junior decides yeah, yeah, to leave it. Last 10 let, let seconds. Yeah. And, and there we have it. Lando Junior is on Makachev. Makachev has the lead for the three rounds, but it's up to the judges. Yeah, so now we're going to go to the judges' decision that it should be the second second win in M1 for Islam Makachev, talented 21-year-old Russian lightweight. 
He stays undefeated. Now his record is 9 and 0. And it will be very, very interesting to see him in the next fight. His next fight is probably going to be against some of the top, top 3 M1 lightweights. M1 has a lot of great lightweights in, in this division. Ex champion Daniel Weichel, current champion Musa Kamanaev, European prospect Mayrbek Tysonov. So it should be a great fight. Well, ladies and gentlemen, after the three rounds of last year, we go to the judges' scorecards. And we have a winner by the way of unanimous decision. Islam Magistan! The unanimous decision win for Islam. You could expect that. Very good win. I'm here with your winner, Islam Magachev. Three rounds of fantastic action. He said he was going to stand with you, but we realized from round one that that was just a game plan to get you on the ground. Were you expecting that? Отличный бой. До этого твой соперник говорил, что он будет биться в стойке, но тем не менее в первый раунд показал, что его план это переводить в партер. Что скажешь об этом? Ну, я знал, что он будет бороться с этим представителем школы джиу-джитсу. И готовился под это. Знал, что он будет переводить бой в партер и там уже бороться. Uh, I knew because he is a jiu-jitsu fighter and I was pretty sure he's going to wrestle and take him to the ground. Well, we noticed from round one to round three, you seem to get your second win. You seem stronger in the third round. Is that something you always do, or was it because you knew you were ahead that you went stronger and you wanted to make sure that you won this fight? В первых двух раундах, может быть, немножко уступал, в третьем активизировался и показал хороший бой. Таков был план? План был работать в стойке, если повалю добить. И вот я дрался по плану, и вот выиграл, так получилось. So my plan was to uh, spend the fight in a stand-up position and take him to the ground probably and make some ground and pound and that's it. Well, that's exactly what you're doing, ladies and gentlemen. Your winner is Islam Makhachev. Хочу сказать спасибо организаторам этого турнира, всем болельщикам, моему тренеру и моему брату Курбану. Всем спасибо. I want to thank you, all the fans, the promoters, my trainer, and my brother. Thank you, Islam Makachev. Second victory for young Russian prospect from Abdulmanab Nurmagomedov School.